under the tower still with my family all the time. Now, once upon a time, long, long ago, there was a fox and her child, Ben. They lived in a very nice place. And Ben had very nice friends. She had Coco the rabbit, Susie squirrel, but then they left. That was them. the biggest day of his life. Most big day of his life. Um. Oh, Ben, we have to talk about something. What, oh, ma'am? <laughs> ben loved exploring. I'm ill. Of what you see, I got bit by the bad foxes. The bad foxes were horrible foxes. They were trying to, who tried to take all their food. And if you but get bitten by them, you get very ill. So you see, I, I can't look after you anymore. I'm too weak. So I'm taking. So you're going to another place called a farm. A farm. You will go now. Okay, no, please, please. Come on, young man, come with me. No, I'm not. It was the toughest decision of his life. He didn't want to leave his mum, but her, his mum urged him to go. He looked back to once more at his mum and went on with the dog. Both of them walked through the forest to their place. Ben was really nervous. He didn't want him to go away. When he came in, he felt trapped, alone. He, he missed his friend so much. Then he looked at me. Then Ben said, Where do I sleep? Come with me. The dog showed him to a little place. Is this your home? Yes, the dog said. Who will be looking after me, said Ben. I will for the moment. I'll be caring for you. Ben was very nervous. He said, let's go to sleep, okay? Then Ben was trying to go to sleep, but he couldn't. So he got up and had a little walk around. And then he, and then he saw at one of the cows was a nurse, and he thought they could they could help my mum be better. So he had a plan that day. So he ran out of the farm. It was very spooky during the night, and he ran all the way back to his mum. Then he got there, he slowed her down, and he saw his mum there. Ben, what are you doing here? Mum, come with me quickly. You've got to see. You've got to come now. So his mum came with him. He walked down the woods. And Ben was, was eager to get there as soon as he could with his mum. Finally, his mum went there, and um, well, um, Ben's mum said, "Is this what you wanted to show me your home?" Then, then, was, then Ben said, "No, no, no! Come with me. Then wait there." So he knocked on the cow's door. The nurse aunt. Uh, a, a, a young cow answered, Hello, um, how can I help you? Hi, I'm Ben, and do you have a nurse there? Yes, my auntie, my great auntie. 
his auntie came out and oh uh, and Ben said, Can you heal my mum please? And then she said, Yeah, sure. So she went up to her mum and she saw the bite. I can heal that in a jiffy. So she went in by a pond and got some water on her hoof and put over her head and she said, There, how does that feel? It feels better. Ben's mum said, I can move. Thank you so much. Thank you, George. And then George said, I quite like it here. Can we move in here, mum, please? Okay, so from that day on, everyone liked him there. And he didn't feel very, very different from the rest. He got on with everyone in the end. And, and, and sometimes his old friends would pop over to see him and say, Hiya, Ben, how are you doing? Fine. And they lived happily ever after. The end. If you want to see another one of my stories, well, um, go, um, oh, um, um, type in on YouTube, Girl Sings Taylor Swift Trouble, and you'll see another one of my videos. Thanks for watching. Bye.